both of you. Uh, this segment of the show, we are joined by Myra and Lillian, and they're f- representing Christian Fashion Week. Now, I'm not a fashion model, and this is kind of when Rob said that we were having this, I was like, oh, I don't know what we're going to talk about. I said I would take the majority of this yeah. uh, segment. So we I'm brought kidding. Maria in no, to talk about didn't. fashion. It did not. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Myra, Lillian, tell us what is Christian Fashion Week? <laughs> okay, Christian Fashion Week is a actual Fashion Week event, just like New York Fashion Week and any other Fashion Week, uh, except uh, we're Christians and we love Christ. We're not here to like uh, police hemlines or anything like that. We just love what we do. We love fashion. We love art. We love the creativity. And we're kind of like a group of people that um, a community that's actually just working in her in their talents, models, designers, artists. Um, you know, we're not represented by any church. And you've, you've had one event already, correct? Yes. Last night we had the kickoff event uh, at the garage. Uh, downtown In downtown Martinsburg? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. And, and what uh, was that event? Well, we were doing the kickoff, uh, showcasing a local artist named David Bosley. Uh, from right here in Berkeley from County? Right, right here in Berkeley, yes. Fantastic. I'm sorry, I'm from Florida, so no. I don't know a lot of... No, I get it. And, and what do we have to look forward to in the next week? Oh, my goodness. It's a lot of amazing stuff. We have models flying in from Texas, from Florida. Um, it's going to be a power pack show, professional designers and, and models and, and exhibitors. Just think Paris Fashion Week, London Fashion Week. It's going to be a quality show. And would like Martinsburg to come out and see this because it's new. We've never had So anything. what do you have on for, t- what's the next event? So the next event is tonight. Tonight? We're having um, art and fashion workshop. Okay. Mm-hmm. And where is that at? At Airborne Church. At Airborne Church. At what time? 6 to 8 p.m. And are tickets available or is it open to the public? That one's open to the public. Okay. Uh, if anyone wants to come to the show, tickets are available at Christian F. W.com. Uh, we have VIP tickets and general mission tickets. The show is on Saturday. Doors open at 6 p.m. at the Purple Iris. So do you have an actual, so does each event actually feature a fashion show, so to speak, or are there different pieces of events um, for this week? So it's different pieces of events. Okay. Like a, uh, so today is kind of like a f- talking forum about what is Christian fashion. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and then Thursday, we are having a Style Lab event at uh, Savannah Grace Boutique, downtown Martins. Yes. So that's going to be a very kind of like, uh, how do I wear, you know, styling. More of an advice thing for, yes, for ladies? Yes, that's going to be more like for ladies, like styling and teaching them how to wear certain clothes mm-hmm. with the clothing from the boutique. Friday is our VIP event. Um, that one is closed. It's only for VIP holders. It's going to be at the Hub from 6 to 8 p.m. And that is a networking event where they get to meet the models, the designers. Um, and then So who are the VIPs? Not by name, but by... Are, are these buyers not for shows? Or, <laughs> I mean, how am I not on the VIP list? That's what I'm getting. No, no who are the VIPs? Are they, are they buyers? <laughs> are they buyers for... for um, designer for show for stores and such. Or? We have media, we have bloggers, um, and then again, we are just looking for those people to showcase these designers to move them forward into okay. um, the possibility of buyers and getting gotcha. connected with people within the industry. How long has Christian Fashion Week been in existence, and is it different weeks all across the country, or because? There's the two of you, but I would imagine there's much, many more of you, correct? Yes and no. So okay. the original Fashion Week, Christian Fashion Week, uh, started in 2013 okay. in Tampa, Florida. Mm-hmm. It ran for three years. The last year we had the fashion editor of the New York Times come to our show and do, the New York Times did a whole piece. After that, it took a hiatus 
a lot of things happened in our lives that made it different, not just COVID. Uh, so now we're resurrect. Uh, it's kind of like the resurrection of Christian Fashion Week. And the first show in eight years is here. So we made it a local. How'd you pick event. here? Lily lives here. <laughs> okay. What a great idea. A long time. So, yes. I, I love this whole premise, the whole idea of having a fashion week in Martinsburg. I know, that, this is, right? This is exciting. And, and I, I, not that I'm into fashion, but it, it's it's something I could go to a fashion show and, and not buy many people a VIP this, ticket. I'm, notwithstanding, I am a fashion expert because I've watched like 10 seasons of Project One Runway. <laughs> so I know everything there is to know about fashion. Well, uh, chime but, in then. So, by all and means. your choice of shirts buyers. over the, the I'm the saying years the, the has evidence been very is the contrary <laughs> notwithstanding. <laughs> now, um, so is there, a, is there a runway show that uh, this part of this and is that something that the non-VIPs <laughs> will be allowed to see? He's trying yes. to get in, ladies. Yes. He's yes. Trying not, to get not as a participant. If you want a ticket, we'll, we'll make it happen. Yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah. Absolutely. Right. Uh, actually, it, it, it would have to be two. Yeah. yeah. Okay, of course. Yes, yes, definitely two. Saturday is the main fashion show sure. event. And that's at the it's Purple Iris. At the Purple right. Iris. Doors well, how, open at 6 p.m. How much are the tickets to to uh, to attend that event? They're $35 general admission and I believe $60. $60 will be it. Okay, yeah. and where do I get the tickets? Say yeah. that one more time. Get them online at christianfw.com christianfw.com um, and then is there anything after Saturday? No, Church on Sunday. Church yeah. on Sunday, right? <laughs> yes. And then Memorial Day? Uh, yes. Uh, and then you're good, good to go. Yes, yes. Good. Anything else you want to mention before we leave you? Come out and support the event. Is no, well, okay, well, I have a, no, so where do the designers come from? Are they, is this a, a, a competitive uh, show? Is it a juried show that, that no, no, no. So one of the designers is 100% sustainable. Her name is Alan Moore, and she comes from Florida. Uh, another designer is actually Salome. She is a local designer. Mm -hmm. From where is she from? She's from Philly, and she's from Uganda. Mm -hmm. So along the region, um, we have another designer that is from Venezuela. Um, and... Uh, we She's, have a student designer, too, from yes. Liberty University. Yes, we also have a student designer from Liberty University. So we have about five designers because this is a smaller show. Um, but, yeah, all the designers, they are original designs. I mean, hand-sewn by them. And So is this the, the kind of show that a designer goes to in hopes that a buyer from Nordstrom's or one of the big stores will see it and say, oh, I want to stock that? Is, is that for see feasible in a show like this? or? Yes, yes. This is a smaller show. We plan to keep growing it as it was before. Um, the last Christian Fashion Week, one of the Christian Fashion Weeks had 75 models and 18 designers. Wow. International designers. Mm -hmm. So because Martinsburg is up and coming, it looks like a great city. By the way, I love being here. Everybody's super sweet and warm. I don't know about this guy over here. <laughs> <laughs> Present no, company. She, That's what for the radio people, she yeah. was pointing at Mike. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, John. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it's just a matter of we want to go to places where there's fresh talent, you know, mm -hmm. and where people don't have the opportunity to showcase their things. Like, I didn't know Liberty University had a fashion design, you know, part of it. So mm -hmm. that's what we're looking for. Okay. Thank you very much for joining us. We Thank really you. appreciate it. We're going to, this part of our show brought to you by Orsini's Home Store. Not just an appliance store anymore. Cabinets and design, bedding, outdoor living, family owned and operated. 360 Hacks Wilson Way, Martinsburg. Thank you, ladies. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Do you have someone in a nursing home? Or are you worried about somebody you love going into a nursing home? The law firm of Daniel Staggers can protect your assets. Call the law firm of